Welcome back to Sven Plays! I'm continuing on my playthrough of Gunstar Heroes because this game is probably the best of all the Genesis lineup. Yes, for me, it even comes out on top of Sonic the Hedgehog. And Golden Axe and Streets of Rage 2. I mean, I love all those games. I replay them all as well, but I don't think any Genesis game in my library has been revisited as often as this one. Seriously, if you have never played it, ever, you can buy this game right now in the Sega Mega Drive Ultimate Collection on the uh, PlayStation 3? No wait, I don't think the PS3 version had it. Well, there's actually the uh, Sega Mega Drive Gold Collection which does have it, which you can buy on PC and on Steam, I believe. I, for one, actually own this on the Wii and on the... I think it was the... Uh, no, not the Vita. Which was the other system I had it on? I honestly can't remember. Nope, I've forgotten. Well, I do own the Wii copy, but I'm this particular copy I am playing on an emulator just because I wanted to be able to record it and I cannot record my Wii. So, but if you want to play this game, honest to God, if you want to play this game, buy it because it is amazing. Well worth, I mean, it's like $3 on Steam right now. Right now. $3. For this game, that is sensational value. I'm freaking jumping onto a ship that's taking off amidst a bunch of skyscrapers with guys dropping bombs on me. Bombs that I can throw back at them. That is just so cool. I don't care what anyone says. This is amazing. Especially for its time. I freaking just love throwing bombs. Look at that. You think Call of Duty picking up someone else's grenade and throwing it back is amazing? No, you, you do it in this game. You'll know what amazing feels like. It just makes you feel like a badass. And that right there is Orange. The boss I'll have to fight on this level. One of the villainous guys. Yes, the names are all terrible. They're literally just named after colors. Well, I think they're all named after colors. Most of them are. Except for like the Emperor. To the damage of my lightning homing gun, you have no hope. Uh, no, the lightning one's working pretty well here. I'm going to keep it. Alright. A mini boss. Let's see what you got in store. Oh, uh, this guy. Okay. Uh, I need to get in the leg. And up I get. I can kick them to do damage. I need to get to target. There we go. Now I can just chill out up here. Uh oh, I did not mean to do that. That's okay, I'll just stand on this leg. And down they go. Healing. Yes, please. It might look like a really easy game, especially since I'm using the homing laser right now. But if you play this on freaking hard mode even it's a very different beast I would not be I'd probably still be on the first level if I was playing this on hard uh, I, I said absolutely no hyper Billy it is really difficult goodbye Colonel Clink all right this is one of the coolest boss fights in the game I freaking love this boss track too. Orange's boss track is one of my favorites. Rotor press, hard shoulder, and break wind. Okay. And you can throw him off the helicopter! You gotta be careful about getting close to him because he can just body slam you. Alright, down. See, it helps because I know his pattern. Dude's got a really insanely strong grip, I gotta say. See, if I was the one being right off the edge, I would lose a lot of health. Oh, jeez, I shouldn't have climbed up yet. <laughs> I 
Down he goes. I literally fought a, a muscled up soldier with a crew cut on a helicopter in the middle of a sky. For the Genesis era, that is freaking awesome. I don't care what anyone says. Third gem, come to me. Yoink. I like that he's buried in the concrete. <laughs> uh, a dice maze. Now this one was actually one of the really more creative ones I've seen. Um, you'll see why soon, but... Just entering this complex, this facility. Trying to get to the last boss who has the, the fourth gem. Then I can hopefully... Stop the, uh... Aha! Melee attacks absolutely rip these guys apart on normal difficulty. But for now, I'm doing A-OK, -okay, just blasting through. This is why I pick free run. It makes it a lot easier to get through the level by just... Wow, oh, jeez. Blasting through. I just love the way you can throw everything. Uh oh. Well, he blew himself up and inconvenienced me slightly. In we go. This is what's cool about it. It's an actual board game where you choose whether you get to fight something. And each of these fights is something different. Every fight is a different type of creature. Uh, if you're quick enough when you refro it, you can actually refro the dice over and over so you get a favorable number. This first one's kind of, uh, well, yeah. Here, Wormy. Again, each of these would be more difficult on hard mode. I want to stress that. It looks like a cakewalk here because it is on normal difficulty. Hard and expert, completely different ball game. Whee! 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 All right. I want a good number. Three. And at the end of it, you get to the boss fight. Alright. One of those, is it? Alright. Uh, this is a tricky one. Oh. oh, if I can just get that open again. Because in midair, he does like kick. It makes it very easy to accidentally set them off. Okay. Ah, uh, I just want to... Oh, oh, okay. Not sure how that happened, but I got it. <laughs> I always like the little... Dolia! These guys do as they fruit people, too. Because, in case you didn't guess, this is originally a Japanese game. It was made by Treasure, after all. Treasure are a Japanese developer. <laughs> I'm not sure if they're still actively making games. I think they do, because they made Sin and Punishment on the Wii. This is basically the break the car mode from from Street Fighter, only because it's normal, it doesn't take much to do it. Just do a couple of melee attacks, and you're good. Wow. Alrighty, give me that die. What have I got this time? Free! Oh, an item. Well, I'm pretty happy with my current weapon because I'm dealing with lots of individual bosses at the moment. Now then. Healing items, on the other hand, will be useful. See, if I wasn't using the healing, the, the homing weapon, even that would make normal mode a bit more challenging because I can't aim as freely then. I can't just basically focus on dodging. So this game can be as difficult as you want it to be. Me, for the purpose of this video, for showing off just how cool this game is, I'm just sticking to normal. Like a pussy. The Phantom. Now, see, this is just like a normal guy soldier before. But one of the things I like doing with this guy whoop, is just throwing him around. Just because I can. Like that. Come on, throw the bomb. No, no, no. throw the bomb. I could be killing him right now with my gun, but it's just... <laughs> I 
Yeah, I'll free you. No! <laughs> no! No! Oh, I threw it down below me. There it goes. You gotta be quick in grabbing those, because otherwise you disappear. <laughs> uh. Now then. Whee! Ah, uh, this one's kind of annoying. You can't use your gun, you can only use your fists. But this guy's kind of unpredictable. Well, not unpredictable. Ah! Jeez. Ah! Geez. You see what I mean? <laughs> ah! You go jumping, he just does that. He does those annoying kicks. So getting close to him is not easy. Alright, let's try using this. It's hard to tell when you can hit him, when you can't. It's a very small window. Ah, like that. Ah! You are no you are so annoying! I'm gonna die to this guy, aren't I? Spam! That's all you do! Oh my god. It's like, I shrug off everything else, but as soon as my gun's taken away... I really need to learn this guy's pattern. Let's, I'm gonna watch him for a bit. He does that. What? Oh, you're joking. I'm gonna die, aren't I? I'm gonna die! It's, it's happening! I'm gonna die! Ah. Uh, use my window of invulnerability. Doesn't matter though, what health? I'm gonna have to pull out some pretty amazing shit to not take any damage from this point. Ah. Uh, I hate that one. Come on, free. Give me free. Damn it! <laughs> oh, I'm dead. I am so dead. Did I mention I'm dead? I'm dead. Oh, this guy's easy at least. Just stay back and be careful. I can't even take one point of damage here. Come on, die you son of a... Ay... Alright. Jesus! I swear, if it sends me back to the start in this state, I am boned! <laughs> give me a two. Please give me a two. I know I'm only gonna get like one healing item in there, but... Ah, oh, you son of a bitch! Oh no. Okay, come on. At least have the courage to give me a two here. Come on. Yes! Okay. But still, it doesn't change the fact that I have to get through a few more boss fights. Shit! <laughs> Alright, one healing item. That's better than nothing. Oh man, I'm still gonna get pulled apart though. Ah, oh, damn. This guy's a show, even on normal difficulty, this game can throw curveballs at you. In the case of most of the bosses, it's just because I know them quite well. But that, that, that gunless one, I could just never figure that guy out. Tamarin. Oh, this guy. Now, this one's tricky because they reverse explode. See? Now I can just stand here. Hey, lucky. That's not the last we'll see of that guy. He'll come back later. Ugh, there's always fights ahead. If I'm lucky, I might be able to skip over some of them. No such luck! Ugh. Uh, I'm scared. <laughs> Okay, this guy's a joke. He literally does, like, nothing. <laughs> Bang, you go. Take 
Damn. Damn it! <laughs> Stop looking at me. Okay. Come on. Oh, jeez. Okay, those guys are taken care of. Just get through. No! Get through. Alright. You can just see just the sheer range of little challenge rooms like this. You can just make a whole game like that, I reckon. Now what? Please let me get that item room before the boss. Ah, oh, again, landing on the fight. There's all those empty spaces, but nope, you want me to fight. Oh, this one's kind of nasty. Um. Just pay attention. Nope, focus on that. Alright. It doesn't repeat between the same one, so that's something at least. He's gonna die. He's dead. Alright. Again, if it was harder difficulty, that'd be way worse. Alright. Please, a four. Four. Come on. Come on. God damn. Okay. That's okay. That's not anything. Three. Uh, I'm gonna clear, like, I, I've cleared almost every single fight. Oh, this one with the multiple weapons. Just gotta pay attention here. Ah, I almost walked right into that. Ah, Jesus! Ah! It's, just, it's like, the amount of life I've got, even one of those weak weapons is scary as hell. Almost. Okay. Almost got it. Hooray! You know what's gonna happen, right? I'm gonna die at the boss and I'm gonna have to do this again. I hope not! <laughs> Cause I'm not using save states here, I'm doing it legit. Come on, give me a one. Show me that much mercy after all those fights you put me through. You son of a- <laughs> That last room always just has like two healing items. Uh, this last boss fight isn't too terrible. I've just got to pay attention. You've completed the Dice Palace. Yeah, barely. Yeah, <laughs> soul bonus. All right. Here he is. What? Oh, jeez! I forgot he did that. Oh. Please tell me he continues from the boss. Please tell me he continues from the Fuck! I'm not gonna make you watch all that again, so, uh, see you in a few minutes. I hope. Really? Again? Again with this guy? Ah. Oh, okay. Okay. I had I had another thought on how I could handle this guy. I don't know if it will work though. Okay. The shoulder slam seems like it might. It looks like it's pretty much guaranteed to hit him even if I take a hit in the process. Nope. Damn it! I hate this guy. Like, really, I cannot express just how much, in the pit of my soul, I detest this freaking curry guy. How? When do you hit him? I can't discern the pattern. <laughs> no! Not again! Not this again! You can throw him? 
Oh, but it's like the same situation as last time! <laughs> oh. Okay. I have made it back to him. I was lucky enough to get the item room after that fist fight. So I got a couple of healing items and I managed to soup up my gun to double healing. So I should be able to handle him this time. I just gotta make sure not to be in the corners. Just play it smart. Just play it smart. That's all I gotta do. Alright. Physical attacks are still the best way of doing lots of damage quickly. Oh. Oh god. I forgot about that. Oh, I can't do my sliding kick there. Uh-oh. Oh, that's right, they have different elements. Oh, uh, I don't even know how I walked off the edge there, but I did. Ah. Uh-oh. I like it when you're here. Nice and easy hit. Oh, damn it. You're going down. You're going down. Ah. Jesus. <laughs> it's like, if they made that fisticuff sky the last one. There you go. Nope. Yeah, you look so pleased with yourself, don't you? I can just keep pummeling him. He doesn't die. He's just like, uh, 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 uh! Give me the real one now. Gambler to the end. Alright, guys. Ooh, something bad's gone down. Thanks. While you were away, the Empire came and kidnapped Yellow. Ha, ha, ha! If you want to save Yellow, come to me with all the gems. But that's if you can get to me alive. We must obey him. Please save Yellow. You know, for the, the fate of the whole universe for one girl, I know this is the typical Hollywood style of thing, but it's like, the smart thing, the real world thing, would be to let her go. But, that's the cold and logical way of thinking. So let's save her, next time, on Sven Plays. Really? Again? Again with this guy? Ah.